Hey everyone and welcome back to another video. This time we have... I'm sorry, I'm not gonna look at my channel to see how many videos I made, but this will be like episode 16 or... I don't even know, whatever. We're gonna be racing at Sonoma. The Toyota Seymour 350. And the West Coast paint scheme is back. Yay, I missed it. Um, yeah, not one of my favorite tracks for sure, not one of my best ones by far, and uh, yeah, wish me luck. I really don't know what to say about this race track, this race track, I don't really know what to say about it, it's very hard, I'm not that good at road course, but I may, I may be wrong. <laughs> I haven't practiced this in this as much, but whatever. I'm Alex Hayden, deep in wine country, to bring you all of the action from this 50-plus-year-old racetrack. Sonoma has been a staple in NASCAR since 1989, and we have 40 thirsty drivers looking to put their name in the race winner column. Jeff Gordon holds the record of five wins here, but we have drivers like Martin Truex Jr. inching their way closer to that mark. Nice. Bob Wallace. The airplanes. Which driver is going to get it done today? Let's head trackside here at Sonoma to get the engines fired. And it's Martin Strikes Jr. who started on the pole. Oh, wait. Yeah, look at the data pad. Use the data pad. We're gonna be starting from 25th. Ugh. Why do I always start like the, in the 20s? I literally just started one spot higher than last week at Charlotte, and yeah, I wrecked last week. And it was a noble, so I could have definitely won if I hadn't wrecked. If I hadn't been stupid, but whatever. This one is different. Uh, it's a road course. You guys know. Not that good at road courses. I may be wrong. I, I I usually say that a lot. I say that a lot about road courses, and it's kind of true. I'm not that good at road courses. I usually end up breaking like a ton of people because I, like from the beginning, I misjudge the speed at which we're supposed to slow down and all that. So yeah, I not that good at road courses, but uh, in the end, I always end up like surprising with like a top five or something. But I mean, most of the times when I do well in road courses, I get by a lot of people by wrecking them. I feel like we're going so slow. We're in the 50s, 40s. It's in us in miles per hour, not like the decades. <laughs> we're in the 20s. But whatever. In speed, we're going very slow. And yet, I managed to wreck a ton of people. This track is pretty cool, I like it, but I mean, is it really one of my best tracks? This corner right here gets me every time, it's one of the hardest ones. Or the one with the O'Reilly, yeah, this one. Whoa. Look at my car, it's destroyed already, and it's only lap one out of five. Ah, oh, dang it. We're so screwed, guys. <sighs> now what? That. Yeah, got it. Wrecking more people. This corner right here is the worst corner in all of NASCAR. What's wrong? What, what am I... Oh my god, our bad luck just continues. You know what, I don't care, I'm gonna cut through here. I'm gonna get penalized, but... Here, I'm gonna do the thing where they, like, stop in for, like, two seconds. Here. One, two, there you go, okay, go, 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 oh my god, why did I do that, why am I... <laughs> okay, that was a very dumb thing to do. We're 33rd now, seriously. 
That was the stupidest thing I've done all season. Mm. Even more stupid than last week at Charlotte. <laughs> you guys know. Oh, whatever, it's a road course. Probably gonna wreck like 20 more people. And that's when I'm gonna get to like the top 5 or the top 10. Plus we got three more laps, so who cares? <sighs> that was a good pass on the 53. Stupid camera stopped moving. Whoa, the 41. That looked pretty cool. Okay, this stupid camera. Oh my god. How should I title this video? My worst track ever, or my worst race ever, or just straight up the bad luck continues? <laughs> Because the thing is, I haven't down—I haven't even downloaded the Charlotte episode as of the time that I'm recording this. I still have to download it or copy it into the USB and then upload it and get it ready and all that. So I haven't even named the videos. I—I I know you guys. By the time this, you guys see this, there you there will already be the there's the Charlotte episode will have already been released and yeah, I would have probably already name this video by two weeks before, two weeks prior, you know, because I'm recording this two weeks early. I am recording this in the same, on the same day as the Charlotte episode, and that one came out a week ago for you guys, so yeah. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna call that episode, because as you guys know, by now I did absolutely horrible in that one. Yeah, we were, we were pretty bad. So I might, I might as well just name that like, oh, the Coxes 100 or my longest race ever and then this one, my, my bad luck continues. <laughs> I don't know, you guys know by now what the name of the video is. But as of the time that I am recording this, as of the time that I am speaking, um, I, I have no clue. One of the hardest things about uploading videos is the titles. Titles are definitely one of the hardest things. When it comes to already uh, like actually uploading them, it's one of the hardest things. What was that? Where are we? 18th? Cool. Now what? How do we go from 18th to 1st in one lap? Or more like two, or I don't know, whatever. <sighs> you know what? I'm just gonna shut up. I don't see anything. Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh my goodness. <sighs> Ridiculous. Oh my god, who was that? <sighs> it's unreal. I barely get off the game for one week and I start doing horrible. That is so fun.
this is the view that I wanted. This is this is should be like the official view of the road courses, like the official camera of the road courses. Like the final lap on this on this camera should look pretty freaking cool. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna call that this episode. What should I call this? Well, you guys will already know the title of the video, but as the time that I'm recording this, what should I call it? Or bad luck continues, or my stupidity continues. Maybe both. My stupidity continues. That sounds great. Bruh, this camera is so cool. It's extremely underrated. When I first got into the video game, I was like, nah, who cares about about this view? It's boring. I mean, you... You can't see the car, you can't see the paint scheme, and it's not realistic. Not a lot of times is this camera used in real life. But it's extremely underrated. On the road courses, at least, it works really, really good. I mean, look at this. You get to see, like, the car super close up. And it's not like the other camera, like the in-car camera, where, like, the if you crashed before and the hood is bent or something, you can't you can barely even see like the racing line like the arrows and all that look at that the race is already over but whatever you're one of those people that still use the arrows or whatever mm, I mean it's hard to see you guys know you guys will know it's hard to see when like the cr like the hood is crashed or bent and yeah but this camera allows you to see pretty well and it's really fun it's exciting. I love this camera and it's extremely underrated. I extremely underrated it the first time I used it. Look at this. Speedy Cash. 38. Whoa, we're in the wall. And we finished. I don't even know where. Oh, Alright, let me think of the title. Or Bad Luck Continues or My Superiority Continues. Yeah, I'm just gonna call it that. My Superiority Continues. <sighs> it's weird because I mean the first few races of the season I did pretty well. I have four, if not, yeah, I have five wins this season so far. But I already have like two crashes in a row, and yeah, not the finishes I want. So, Martin Truex Jr. won last year. I mean, and he is the latest winner in this video game. And he win. I mean, in, in this track, especially, especially, specifically in this track, uh, he wins again, and he started from the pole. So yay! Eric Jones finishes second. Ross Chastain third. Brad Keselowski fourth. Kyle Busch fifth. Josh Balicki sixth. Tyler Reddick seventh. Kurt Busch eighth. Chase Elliott ninth, and then number nine, Cruella Joy tenth. That's pretty good. Let's see, I finished 19th, not as bad, considering I destroyed like half the field or whatever. Like half the time I was wrecking, so... <laughs> I mean, better than I expected, right? Whatever, bro. Cody Ware finishes right behind us. We finished like right in between Anthony Alfredo and Cody Ware. Is that speak too good of, about me? <laughs> I don't know, whatever, bro. William Byron, 24th and 24th, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Austin Dillon, 34th, Quinn Half, 38th, and Austin Cedric finishes 40th, right behind Ryan Priest. Good, I guess. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like if you liked it. I will definitely start using the bumper camera, the front bumper camera at least, a lot more, especially on the road courses and the... Um, on and the short tracks maybe I'm gonna try it on a short track as well maybe yeah I liked it it's, it's probably the most underrated camera in all of NASCAR 21 ignition so I will definitely start using it like especially on the final laps when everybody starts to get aggressive and all that that's gonna be really exciting you guys are gonna love it or at least I know that I love it so yeah thank you very much for watching and I'll see you on the next one which would be the all-star race I don't know I don't know. If it's the All-Star Race, get ready. It's going to be a really fun. It's going to be a really fun one.
a really fun episode. It's not, I don't know how I'm gonna make it yet, but it's gonna be really fun. You guys are gonna like it. Yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.